Welcome to Santo, Sam and Ed's Total Football. Think of. Yeah. Can you please welcome the people's fan, Mick Malloy. Yeah. Cockney, you high, high fived a few people. Need a bit of that. By the way, I'd give that a wide berth for five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I really would. That needs no, we, need, we, need the, we need the fourth official holding up a number five. <laughs> <laughs> how are we all? Oh, well, how are you? Thank you for joining us. Uh, yeah. You are the North Australia's at, number one. What are you doing? That? Well, if you do remember, I appeared on. Cup Your fever. World Cup, yeah. Yeah, Cup Fever, yeah. and this is what I got for my appearance. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> it was great to see if, if it's... How many years ago was that? It was in 1958. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> let's see if it slipped back on. You it know, does. it's like a bride getting back into her dress. After. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I went out a lot, you know why? Because it's a dead set chick magnet. Is it yeah. really? Yeah. Yeah. I just walk up to people and go, I know Sam Payne. Whoa! <laughs> Opened some doors, didn't we? Oh, yeah. Where do you do that? SBS function. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you watch it? I watched it at home, mm -hmm. uh, on the couch, mm -hmm. and can I tell you this, in all honesty, I'm, a, I'm very democratic when it comes to sport. I don't have any particular allegiance. Mm -hmm. I uh, sleep around oh, hey. uh, hey. on the sports front, but I started off watching this tournament and I, I, I'm a layman, mm -hmm. so I yeah. take it from me, I'm every man, and it was just awesome. It's okay. the greatest sporting event of the year, of the last couple of years, and it was awesome. That last game, the, the cup final, I was exhausted. Yeah, I was yeah, absolutely yeah. exhausted at the end of that game. Yeah, yeah. You were sitting on a couch. I was sitting yeah. on a couch. <laughs> in my underpants. Wow. <laughs> hey, we hold up the remote. <laughs> it's just it's exhausted just uh, picturing that. But, yeah. it, but it is. It's in just what, emotionally. Mate, it, was, it was a roller coaster. Really, that, really that's was. the one thing about the soccer is that I've noticed, and I've been to a few World Cups, and a lot of qualifiers from the 80s and the 70s, believe Ooh. it or not, but we always do things the hard way. Yeah, it's we just do. we yeah, don't yeah, do, yeah. We, you know, it's it's not normal unless we do things the hard yep, way. They make no, it and you kind of knew that the South Koreans were going to come back and they yep. played so well and okay. you knew it was just inevitable and then we went on it just had everything so it was just fantastic and then culminating in one of the more perverse kind of celebrations afterwards I thought well, yeah. well, with the cup and the celebration oh, and yeah. uh, where was our Prime Minister? Oh. oh, can I ask you where was yeah, our where Prime Minister? The, because he's definitely not now, in Queensland. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the police witness protection scheme. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> traditionally, Prime Ministers have to be asked Shame. to leave a major sporting event, so especially true. one where the national where, teams where in a major final. National team, well, there's international exposure. He was there at the opening, wasn't he? he oh, well, I think we got Amy Park. We were there. Oh, this is the opening match at Amy Stadium. I yeah, think. Yeah, yeah, Have yeah. a listen to his reception. Yeah, that is that is blatter level booing. Oh. That is. <laughs> That's up there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you have to remember that is that is pre Sir Prince Philip. Oh wow! That's, yeah, you're so, right. <laughs> in fact, if he turned up, they'd still be booing now. Yeah, so, it's still good decision. Good, good decision. That it one, was. Can you think yeah. of a worse one? Could you think of a, a, worse, a worse knighthood? A worse knighthood. I don't think. I don't think. Ralph Allen Allenby. Sir Peter Hall. Yeah. 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 Sir yeah. 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 Peter Hall. Oh. <laughs> But even that's serial pests. So, so, so serial, serial, serial pests, pests might be the one. But look, I loved it. It was just fun from start to finish. It was a great showcase of the game in mm. Australia. All my mates again who just watched got straight into the soccer. Mm. And what a great side! And uh, mm. you know, and Do you well reckon, uh, remember when the Wallabies were our side? You know, even though yeah. we didn't quite understand the, the rules of rugby, it's like something happens. Well, I um, remember the days. <laughs> <laughs> something happens. But, 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 there. They're, but they're our team. Yes. Now yeah. you would think that you know you don't need to be. A football fan to just say, yeah. you know, I like this side. I like Ange. Yep. Yeah, this is sure. my team. This is the team that I want. I like to the see. way they play. Like I yes. know we've, we've had all these very stern European coaches for so long, and all of a sudden they're playing in a way the that we like. He did what he said he was going to do, which mm -hmm. was broaden his base, I believe is the term, yeah. and unearthed all these great players. Yeah. And we'd have to rely on K. Where's Cahill going? Did I he's going. To, well, we, the details are coming out now, but he's going off to China, Mickey. So he's 34. He's got himself, I think it's a two-year deal. There's millions and millions of dollars on the table for him to go over there and get to and play. What do we know about China? Uh, it's a big country. There's a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> what do we know about the soccer? Do you know anything about it's, it? They, well, what? No, they, they know lots about soccer. He used to be an ambassador. <laughs> he doesn't know anything anymore. But it's... What I heard, I heard, <laughs> when they form a wall, you can see it from the moon. Hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> that, is a, uh, that is a long way to go, but well worth it. Well, it's been great. 
He's really getting into the spirit of the Asian Cup. He's sitting on a lazy Susan. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, my question though, when did you know? Boys, because Mickey's mentioned that we've had the new guy, the Australian coach now, and that we've changed our style, we brought new players in. When did you know? When did you two and Mickey, when did you start thinking, OK, the ship's been turned around in the right direction? I think that uh, in October, when we lost 1-0 to Guitar, I thought... Good <laughs> 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 the building, There was real momentum going yeah, there. Yeah, really good I thought the, the building blocks were set up with Holger Osik. Oh, yeah. Osik, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, was it 6-0? Six, six yeah, then, when we yeah. lost 6-0 two yeah. times in a row. Let's uh, not forget the pillars of the game plan that Pim Verbeek put in place. Oh, Pim Verbeek. should be very thankful for the time that Charlie Anko stood aside and Alan Davidson and became captain of the side. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was, that was I knew we turned no, it's the a trip down memory lane. It sure is. When we got 10,000 Twitter followers, I thought, yeah, the soccer is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought they really turned it around. When now. we found out that our striker was from Swindon Town, yeah. <laughs> I was starting to feel pretty good. And yeah. now, yeah. what a fairy tale. Germany. Well, fine. We traditionally are bitches. You know, <laughs> <laughs> we beat them last time. We beat them well, last time. Well, the last time I saw the. Socceroos yes. was in Spain, uh, but bigger part at the World Cup. You were at the World Cup. I was at Caratiba. Hey, sorry, sorry, sorry. Where was that? Where were Caratiba. <laughs> Caratiba. <laughs> I can't believe I'm going to do this. I have never corrected anyone in my life. But <laughs> that place is called Kutachiba. <laughs> 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 a bit late to tell me. Yeah. <laughs> there was a song back there. Where were you when I needed you? What's it called? Oh, I can't say it again. No. <laughs> it's called Kutachiba. Yeah. Kutachiba. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's a song called uh, uh, I Say Kutachiba, You Say Kutachiba. Yeah. <laughs> well, cool. I, I, saw you, I, I saw one of the clips of you there in Brazil. Were you getting carried? You got carried around a stadium by a guy who. A oh, guy who he lives in the. Um, in the slums? In, in the, the slums, the and he used to carry fridges. Yeah. Up the, his job was carrying fridges up the slums, and we met him out the front. Yeah. And uh, we said for Jake, well, we'll see how good you are. See if you can carry me to my seat. <laughs> <laughs> he gave up at row G. <laughs> 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 this isn't going to work. It did pretty well. And I made him pick me up and take me to the toilets. Which <laughs> yeah, of course. Anyway, so that crazy. was so fun. But I was in... in a, where was no, I? No, you were at Kutachiba. Kutachiba, yeah, yeah. and I was watching Australia play Spain, and I was I remember at the time being really upset because when the, uh, they did the, the anthem for Spain, mm. they, the whole crowd started booing. Oh. And I thought it was Australians because they were wearing, you know, wearing yellow tops. So it only transpired later. It wasn't. It was all the Brazilians who turned up. Just yeah. to boo the Spanish because it was their last game, right. and they wanted to see them off. Wow! Yeah, wow! That's sportsmanlike. That, that <laughs> that's commitment. That is. Yeah, you're yeah. right. That is I'm commitment. To to that All those Spanish would have been booing the, oh. the, the, the Brazilians when they lost. Uh, what seven? What, Man, seven imagine seven they would have booed Tony Abbott. Oh, 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 yeah. 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 I remember bumping into you before your trip because I remember you oh. you were strutting around at Melbourne. It doesn't you... sound like me. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to the, I'm going to the World Cup. I'm going to the World Cup. I'm going to see Socceroos, and you. Um, did you miss the game against? Uh, uh, it was the Netherlands. No, no, it was uh, Chile. Colombia. Yeah, Chile, you missed. Chile. No, you missed. Oh, you missed Colombia. This, this, this tournament, right. you missed Chile. You missed the, yeah. our great game. Oh, I got arrested you... out the front of the Americana before. <laughs> it, you got arrested. I got arrested. Yeah, I like it's a long story, <laughs> <laughs> and I can't talk about it because it's before the courts. I think it was. It was for ticket scalping, but we ah. weren't. We, to tell you the truth, this is all they cared about. The FIFA Ethics Committee <laughs> is, you know, this guy's being stabbed to death, but apparently. Apparently, I've offloaded a ticket at face value. <laughs> <laughs> beaten to a bloody pulp. <laughs> Americana, is that how you pronounce it? Maracanã. <laughs> <laughs> This has been a production of Fox Sports.